In this short series on inspirational leadership, we're looking at the idea of creating space. And we've said that as a leader, we need to create space, not a void. And one of the things we've said is that creating space is actually about giving parameters, not just a void where there's no parameters. And another way of looking at that and talking about it is the idea of empowered delegation. Now this great little book called Building Leaders by Mancini and Malfras has a great little section about what it is to empower leaders. And the point that they make is that there's a difference in when you're creating the space and creating the boundaries. There's a difference between authority and responsibility. Now when you're creating space for people and you're giving them the opportunity to lead and you're giving them opportunity to be involved in ministry, Malfurus and Mancini make this very insightful comment about what it is to be, have empowered delegation and that is what you need to do is give away authority and you need to hold on to responsibility. Now if you hold on to both or give away both, which we're going to look at in the next couple of sections, you actually don't give empowered delegation. Another way of saying that is the whole idea of you want to tell people what you want to see happen not how you want to do it. Now, often we fall for it because we think we know everything, sometimes we do, but other times we don't. What we want, what we do is to say, this is exactly how you must do it. And, and that just disempowers people. It's not creating space, it's just getting them to do your thing your way. Tell people what you want to see happen. Don't just tell them how you want everything to happen. So here's something to reflect on. As you consider the, the space that you're creating and reflect on the way that you delegate, are you delegating in an empowered way? Are you telling people what you want? Or are you tending just to lecture them about how you want them to do it? <laughs>